We're back now on 41 Today with some breaking news. We're going to take things over to 41 NBC Skylar Henry. He is live in Macon where crews responded to an accident. I'm sure probably because of this, these dangerous icy conditions we've been seeing on the road. Skylar, what is going on? Melissa, I'm on Harvard Avenue and Columbus Road. You heard Amanda talk earlier in this newscast about how safe you have to be on these roads, and this is why a truck hydroplaned off of the road and into a building, a vacant building, and hit a fire hydrant. Now gallons and gallons of water are leaking onto the road. Police have been out here for the past 30 to 45 minutes just trying to figure out how they can stop this guy there from stopping. I'm actually a uh, tow truck is right behind me right now. They're getting rid of the truck now. The fire hydrant is actually under the truck. They've actually got that removed, but the gallons of gallons of water are still spilling out here. We were the first news crew on the scene as this happened. Police crews are still trying to figure out what they're going to do to make sure that this uh, the geyser of, from the uh, water stops. What's going to happen is these cold temperatures is going to cause all of this water that's on this road to freeze over. So crews are trying to make sure they do everything that they can to make sure drivers stay as safe as possible. Again, if you don't have to drive today, do not do that because roads are still icy. It's still snowy right now. What we'll do is we're going to stick around here. We're going to see what crews are going to do to make sure that everything stays safe. Once again, we want to make sure you stay safe as you drive on these roads. If you don't have to drive, please don't. Please don't. We'll have more tonight at 6 on the 41 NBC News at 6. For now, reporting live in Macon, Skylar Henry, 41 NBC News.